The African Union wrapped up its annual summit on Sunday. CGTN's Daniel R. Moy sat down with the African Union Commission's Deputy Chair to discuss the continental body's achievements. Take a listen. Welcome to our show, Madam Deputy Chairperson. Now, to begin with, in July 2002, the African Union was officially launched in Durban, South Africa, replacing its predecessor, the OAU. And later this year, in July, the African Union will be celebrating its 20th anniversary. Now, take us a little bit back on the achievements and the challenges of the organization as far as your docket is concerned. Our union has come a long way. It's been 20 years since uh, it was launched, like you just said. And ever since, uh, it really um, recommitted itself to the Pan-African vision. Our vision as African Union is um, for a prosperous, integrated, peaceful Africa that is putting forth its own citizens and it's working to claim it's a well-deserved place in the global arena. When institutional reforms kicked off in 2016, what has been the AU's progress in key areas such as financial sustainability, operational efficiency of the AU structures in delivering on its mandate? The union has been really focusing on issues of um, uh, peace and security, issues of economic uh, prosperity, integration, issues of social development, um, issues of um, uh, promoting rural agriculture, issues of trade and, uh, and others. 